Hey everyone, today we're going to be bringing you some deals coming from Amazon because they have sort of a big deal week where they're doing brand new sales every single day. So the sales are changing and we're going to bring you today's best deals for Nintendo Switch because you know what? They actually have a number of games, including first party Nintendo games on some deals that to me are an absolute steal. Even brand new games from Nintendo this year year it's pretty cool now caveat is you do need to be an amazon prime member i know a lot of you already are but if you're not that is sort of that one caveat here to this deal but you know what hey the other day we went over a bunch of gamestop deals and these deals are in addition to and different from what gamestop has going on so hey guys what are you guys doing I'm Nathaniel Rumpeljantz. We're on our road to 150,000 subscribers. I would love it if you would drop a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel if this is something you're interested in and you want to see more sales videos for this holiday season. And you know what, guys? Go ahead and smash that bell icon to be notified of all future uploads and live streams, including our Nintendo Prime podcast that's live tonight at 8 p.m. Central. All right, without further ado, Let's just dive right into the sales, and I'm going to tell you guys right now, we're going to be going over our top nine suggested games, the best deals we were able to find on Amazon for today's Prime Deals, and then we're also going to give you a couple items that I actually use around my studio for those interested in maybe building up your own content creation or streamer setup. All right, first let's dive into our very first deal, and that deal is for Mario plus Rabbid Sparks of Hope. Yeah, folks, it's on the prime big deal today, and it is down to $19.99. $19.99, one hell of a deal. Now, this isn't the you know deluxe edition that comes with the DLC, but still a really good deal for Sparks of Hope, an amazing game, and one you guys should definitely check out. The next game we're going to look at here is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge on Nintendo Switch here. It's also on the prime big deal. It's down from $34.99 to just $22.99. This is definitely something that is a great value for what is honestly the best Ninja Turtles game probably since my early childhood. Next up, we have Mario Golf Super Rush, and this one's down to $39.99. Now, this one has dropped to $39.99 several times, but I do find Mario Golf Super Rush at this price range to be a much better value than when I bought it at launch for $59.99. This isn't the best deal out of the stuff we're going over today, but I did think I thought it was noteworthy to at least show it to you if you've been waiting for this game to not be at MSRP. Next up, we have Super Mario Maker 2, and this one, again, it's not the biggest sale or biggest deal out there, but finding this game for $39.99 isn't always easy. So I just wanted to include this on the list because you know what? That is a deal that I would find Mario Maker actually worthwhile at. And the same thing is true here for Metroid Dread, of course. The caveat here is for some reason, Metroid Dread only has a digital code at this price. The physical copies are sold out. I don't know if they sold out early this morning or something, so this is all that's left. But anyways, I just wanted to be honest with you guys. It's only for the digital copy, but you know what? Metroid Dread's fantastic, and it's still worth it at $59.99 in my opinion, let alone $39.99. So to me, this is an absolute steal for how good this game is. Well, next up, we get to a very interesting one. Octopath Traveler 2 here on Nintendo Switch. See, it's on sale for $42.25, which is absolutely worth it for what this game is. The crazy thing is the PlayStation 5 version's on sale for like $27. I don't really understand why the PlayStation 5 version is on such a steep sale and the Nintendo Switch one is on a smaller sale, but we are a Nintendo channel. I just wanted to be frank and honest with you guys that there is an actual like super cheap version of this on another system. But for $42.25, I do still find this game to be worthwhile. And remember, this is a new game this year. So, yeah, good deal. Next up, we get to one of the biggest deals on this whole list. This is the one, to me, that's the biggest deal. This was a brand new first-party Nintendo game. Came out back in January. And, but bam or I guess you can call it a second-party intelligent systems, whatever. Fire Emblem Engage, guys. $29.99. What an absolute steal for today's thing. 50% off. Damn, this is like the best deal we've looked at so far. And honestly, you guys better jump on this before it's too late because this is only a one-day deal. Next up, we have an indie darling. And 
Honestly, one of the best games to come out in the last decade in Cuphead. It is down from $39.99 to $24.99. A complete deal, a complete steal for me at this price. Yeah, you might have found cheaper deals on other platforms here and there, but honestly, Cuphead is worth spending $25 on. If you love difficult platforming games, you're going to love Cuphead. Go ahead and pick this game up right now. Now, the last game we're going to look at today here is the Ori Collection. Not the greatest of deals, $24.99 when it's usually selling for $31 roughly, but still a really, really good you know, collection of games. And since you get both of the Ori games in here, you're only paying about $12.50 per game. That, to me, is well worth it for what I feel are some of the best indie games on the market. Now, all nine of those games will be linked down in the description. They will be affiliate links. Obviously, you don't have to use the affiliate links if you don't want to, but I appreciate the kickback. It's really not that much. It's like a 1%, so not a big deal. But hey, we do have those affiliate links down there. The last thing I really wanted to go over, though, were two items I actually use almost daily when I'm doing content or specifically live streams because the stuff is on sale. And if you want to get into what I'm doing, uh, yeah, you can have a look at these products and see what I do on, you know, not everything I use is on sale, unfortunately. Some of my most expensive stuff isn't on sale. Like some of you guys might want to deal on the Rodecaster Pro 2. Yeah, no, not on sale. This microphone, nope, not on sale. That doesn't mean some stuff isn't on sale. And first we got to start with, well, a capture card because to do any sort of live streaming, you need one, right? You can use this Elgato HD60X to stream your uh, Nintendo Switch. You can stream your Xbox, your PlayStation, whatever console, as long as it has an HDMI hookup. But what's really neat about it as well is you can hook cameras up to it too. I know this because I've had to do that when I broke one of my, uh, you know, I had a streaming stick at one point. And yeah, I broke it. So I was using the Elgato HD60X a little bit uh, before I switched over to a video switcher. But Either way, the Elgato HD60X is on sale here for $149, uh, 49, which is basically 150 bucks. Usually it's 180. You can see, you know, heck, I purchased this thing just this year and I, I paid full price. It wasn't on sale. So um, it's a very, very good capture card to get your variable refresh rate. You got 4K 60 HDR10 pass through. So, you know, even though you're not recording at 4K, you're only recording at, at uh, 1080p you are able, or, or obviously, you know, streaming to your computer at 1080p, you still can get the 4K60 signal out to your TV, um, unlimited capture, instant game view, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, a very good product and one that, again, I use all the time. Anytime you guys see me game stream or any game footage that's been captured, this is what I've been using. And what I like about suggesting this one is it does work with PC and Mac. My hard thing was some of my old capture card equipment didn't work with my Mac when I switched off a PC, but this one absolutely works with both. It's an external capture card, very easily portable. Can't suggest it more than enough. I love it. Plus, you get a good warranty from Amazon and obviously from Elgato themselves, who is a fairly trustworthy company. Now, of course, that's not the only item we have. One last item to show you guys here is something we use on our live stream sometimes. And you guys haven't seen me use it in all the intended ways in a little while, but that's because it's so versatile. And of course, we're talking about the OBSBOT Tiny Webcam 4K PTZ AI Power Tracking and Auto Framing 4K Webcam with Microphone Noise Reduction Gesture Control 60 FPS HDR Low Light Correction Web Camera for PC Streaming Meeting Etc. Uh, we'll show you an example of what this thing looks by like. showing on Mr. Pumpkin in a moment. Now this is even perfect because it's gonna be a digital zoom. But the point is that this is on sale for 191 right now, which is a big deal because I paid the full price of 270 uh last year so like to see this on sale for 191 to me is an absolute steal and yes it really will follow you around you could turn on the ai tracking you want to do live streams where you're walking around you probably should have a boom mic or a uh, wireless microphone while you're doing that so people can actually hear you talk but still it is an absolute steal at this price and i you know what this is something i've personally used and been using for over a year and it's really really great and you know what if you want to see how great it is guys Take a look at Mr. Pumpkin, and this is using its little digital zoom. That's not half bad. That's not half bad. Of course, I'm not showing off the AI tracking features, but what are you going to do? Uh, you can't always show off all the stuff that you want to show off uh, because it just... It would make this a much more complicated video than what it was supposed to be, which is just showing you guys a bunch of sales. So I do want to thank you guys for tuning in. Hopefully 
you found some good deals here, or maybe while browsing, you find some even better deals that you're more interested in. Obviously, there's a lot of products I could link to. As an example, there's a ton of Nintendo Switch accessories on sale, and I'll put a general link to Nintendo Switch accessories down below as well, but I didn't really find anyone in particular like amazingly priced to go over because there's so many different accessories. None of the official ones, though, like Nintendo Switch Pro Controller, nah, not really on sale, but, but... Uh, you could probably find things like the Hori pads and Power A controllers and all that sort of stuff. There's so much of it that, again, we'll put a general link to the Nintendo Switch accessories down below if you want to go take a look. Anyways, guys, let me know if you enjoyed these sales videos and if you want m more of them because let's be honest, we're at the very beginning of sales season. There's going to be a ton of this stuff over the next few months and I, I probably enough for me to make a video every single damn day. So if it's something you're interested in, let me know and we'll keep it going. I will be back in a future video, and I'll catch you later. <laughs> <laughs>